Hello guys, my name is Rishav Raj and I'm a second year student at Bits Pilani and this video is about Bitsat 2021 spot round. So yeah guys, as you uh, know or you would be knowing spot round right now going on in which everyone is allowed like if you are in the waiting list or you are you have not yet applied for Bitsat, you, have, you are still getting a chance to apply for it and the date is over it was over finally that uh, it was told that the result would be on 10th of january but because of some technical issues it came on 12th of january and then again because of some technical issues it was retracted and it finally came on 13th of january so because it came late on 13th of january i also have the analysis today that is 14th of january and i would be telling you the results so as you know why is a spot round conducted this is a general question so the spot round is conducted in order to fill the vacant seats and this has been done in the history of bitsat for the first time first of all so yeah it does not it has not been done before and as expected i would like to tell you the cutoffs have seen a drop of like two to three marks not more than that about the lower branches it have seen a little more drop but it has not seen a drop of more than five marks so that is the current analysis and I would also like to tell you about the you know statistics soon and also I would like to tell you that this is the special iteration 1 and there would be one more iteration that is special iteration 2 and I would certainly update you about that also. Also I would request you if there is any mistake in the data I would be presenting I would request you to comment the right data and because I may be wrong and you may suggest the changes. And you can also keep a margin of like plus minus one two marks so that's the thing so let's begin so guys uh, before telling you the results i would also like to tell you about the schedule the th thing was that the annou announcement of uh, special spot admission round and all was done on 3rd january and the deadline to apply was given till 8th of january so now you cannot apply for sure and the announcement was expected on 10th but it came on 13th other than that, if I would like to tell you, there were certain more things like uh, reporting is to be done on 17th and the deadline of payment of fees uh, has to be done before 20th. So these things you have to keep in mind and also you would be watching the slide and hence uh, you can understand and you can also check it on the official website of Bitside 2021. So that's the thing. Let's move on to the cutoffs. Okay guys, first of all, I would like to tell you about the Pilani campus and the Pilani campus, I have more data, uh, you know, in comparison to Goa and Hyderabad because I am currently in Pilani campus and I have more contacts there. So yeah, first of all, I'd like to tell you that uh, CSE ended at 365, which uh, if you consider the 11th iteration cutoffs, it was around 368. So it fell like two, three marks. And then if you talk about EC, it, uh, it is at 324, Triple E is at 307 and ENI is at 297 you can consider and you can consider a fair share of margin also if I continue MSc economics is at uh, 291 and chemical is at 225 MSc mathematics is at 260 MSc physics at 254 mechanical at 260 and civil is at 202 so this is what the data I have got. I conveyed it to you and now I would like to go on to Goa. So if I talk about Goa, the CSE, first of all, the CSE is at 330, you can consider. And EC is at 300, Triple E is around 280. And if I talk about ENI, it is around 260. Uh, you can consider it below 260, I would suggest. And MSc Economics is also around 260. You can consider it above 260 and mechanical is at 240 msc mathematics is at 232 so this is the data i have got and now i'd like to tell you about the hyderabad campus there also i have a little more information more than goa so if i talk about uh, hyderabad then cse is at 321 that is confirmed and then if i talk about ec it is at 293 triple e is at 266 eni is at 254 msc economics is at 250 and mechanical is at 230. So guys, uh, one more thing, if you don't know, EC is electronics and communication engineering 
triple e is electrical and electronics engineering eni is electronics and instrumentation engineering and uh, this was the cut of data and if you require any more videos about bits pilani any more videos about bits at 2022 i would suggest you comment it and then only we will be able to know what videos you want and uh, certainly it would be a good feedback and uh, that is it thank you for watching and i hope you like my videos and also if you don't know i am a second year student at bits pilani and you may ask any doubts i am from electronics and instrumentation branch Thank you for watching the video.